Hi, it's me again with Corel Gold Tips and Tricks. And earlier today I made a flower and I made it in Corel X7. And somebody commented or sent me an email and said, Why don't you just use X18 Symmetry Tool? Well, not everybody has Corel 2018, but it does make a nice flower. So I've got a circle. I'm going to do the exact same video, but I'm going to use the Symmetry Tool. I'm going to hit the plus sign on my keyboard. And I'm going to move down to it says quadrant. Whoop. I must not have hit the plus sign. So let's just move it up. I'm going to hit the plus sign. And I'm going to move it to this intersection. I'm going to hit the plus sign. And I'm going to move the new one to this intersection. And now I've got this shape. I'm going to use the smart fill tool to fill that in. I'm going to move it away. Let's just get rid of our circles now. This with the symmetry tool, it's a lot easier if you would turn it at a 90 degree angle. Then go up to object, symmetry, create a new one. You're going to come up with this line, have it touch, take your X, put it in the middle. Then go up and do three or two. And then if that's a good enough flower, but you could go here, click on this box, break it apart. Let's check it. Let's have no fill. Let's go up to object, ungroup. Let's select it all and let's weld it. And there's your other another another style of flower with Corel 2018 symmetry tool. Anyway, hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.